Hey y'all, so I got a package. This is my Halloween packaging swap um, from Rachel. And it's so cute. She put the little clings, like the Halloween clings. And I didn't want to cut the pumpkin because I could like probably pull them off and reuse them. But she used little Halloween window clings and she has the skulls. I'm trying not to show her address. Mine I don't care about because mine's public. Um, but look how cute. She put the pumpkins all on it. All around. Isn't that cute? And it's a nice big box. She lives locally to me. She lives only about an hour away from me. Which was really fun. She was like so excited to see that. <laughs> someone in her state. She was swapping with someone in her state. Alright. Let's open this up. So much more fun is what the top of the top of the box says happy Halloween Brittany oh look how cute oh my god I bought a couple of these she knows I love Frankenstein I told her I love Frankenstein she bought me the little fake um, so it says happy Halloween Brittany so I'm still working on her her pack her stuff is basically all done. I just have to pack it up nice and do a video. So we have some worms. Look at all the worms. Alright. I'm gonna move all the worms. Here's her card. So this was on the Facebook group Girl Gone Paper Crafter. Girl Gone Paper Crafter. And it's my dear friend's page. Okay, so here's her card. It's a witch. And she loves, like, witchy things. So, say, what can I say? Thank you doesn't seem to be enough for your guidance, understanding, month. Mostly your patience. I've crafted my whole life. But the, but the paper end of this is pretty new for me. I'm trying to build my staff and supplies little by little. Have way more to learn. I do hope you enjoy this and that. My frustration my mistake doesn't come through too much in the final products. I know you can make it amazing. Keep being the absolute awesome creator you are. True to you. Thanks again. Happy Halloween, Rachel. Oh, so sweet. Look how cute her card is. Okay. Um. I forgot what we had a... So, I wrote down the requirements. But, we'll see. Okay, so let's take everything out. I like how she packaged everything so cute. And I love she put it in the little Frankies. Look! Now I don't have to hoard the ones I bought. Oh, so cute. Okay, she's going to love my package. I really hope she loves my package. Girl, you went crazy, OMG. Um, okay, she labeled everything. Cute. Okay. Okay, let me just... Sweets. Oh boy. This is heavy. What is in here? Because, like, her swap is basically right there. So she, like, choice. Oh, this was her. Okay. Oh, look, she sent me extra goodies. Well, I'm sending her extra goodies too. But look how cute. I love the little Frankies. Oh my god. The Frankensteins are so cute. Alright. And then here's her bag of crepe paper because we had to make a crepe paper mix. And I got a ton of extra because she threw it. You used like five bags in here. So let me see if I can find the requirements that I can. I have it on my phone, I think. So I can at least tell you guys what was, like what was, what we were supposed to do. Obviously I cannot speak. Um... Let me see. I have it here somewhere. Of course, my phone's going to freeze. I dropped it in the toilet this morning. 
and I grabbed it right out. <laughs> I had no hesitation. I was just like, nope, grabbed it. <laughs> and luckily, from what they said, that the iPhone 7 was waterproof. Thank God. Because I would have cried because I have a show this weekend and I wouldn't have gotten a new phone in time. <laughs> that would have been a big uh oh. Okay, so for our kits, we had to make kits of 10 bag toppers, 10 bags, 10 shaped boxes, 10 policy or coin envelope, like envelopes, um, and then one packaging kit of your choice. In addition, you have to do one crinkle bat mix bag, which is this one here. So cute. So there's that one. Let me move this that way. You can stare at my ugly carpet. Um, two confetti mix bags, one sequin mix bag, ten doilies, five yards of trim, three yards of baker twine, five yards of crepe paper, three tassels, ten gift tags size number three, um, five bows, one package of jewels, washi samples, at least five, one bag full of die cuts, and one bag full of knickknacks. Okay. So I love that she packaged them in these little Frankensteins. I'm going to save these because I can store them. In. And she put more crinkle paper in here. So I think here's most of her bags and stuff. So um, let's see. Is this... Okay, so here's her 10 gift tags. Look how cute she packaged it. So let's open them up. So she has her string in here to tie them. If you can see that. So look how cute. So they say poison, spooky. We have some rosettes. Oh, I think these are her embellishments for, because you can make with embellishments, so you can make like the embellishments to go on the tag. So it's basically for us to put together. So these are, I guess, her little embellishments to put. I'm not even like, let's zoom in more, right? That would make sense um, for her tags. So here's her little tags. Super cute. She did like a nice creepy little Halloween theme for me. Love the paper. Super cute. So there's her tag kit. So adorable. I hope she loves my stuff. And then here's her bag of die cuts. So let's go through this. I wish I had one of my little Halloween trays so I had something to like dump it in. But I guess we're just gonna go at it. All right. So there's a couple pieces that fell out here. Some glitter pieces. There's a whole bunch of, um, there's some of the, um, Target pieces. I included some of those in her kit as well. Um, and then there's a ton of these glitter and there's some pumps. So there's some pumpkins. There's this little um, candelabra. This cute witch die, which I know is from Allie, and I've been wanting to get this forever. So she has a solid one and a glitter one she cut out. She has some. Um, poison pieces. She has some punch circles. More of the pieces from Target. Again, some more poison labels. Another tag. Some words. Um, little coffin. Another poison label. Some more punch circles. And she has these big punch circles so I can make my own like embellishments and such. And then some more coffins. Looks like she stamped them. Some more punch circles. Another witch. Some of the little trees. And then some more sayings. And some cute candy corn stamps that I can color in and cut out. And I'll put that back in that bag. Alright. Then we had to make bows. So here's her bows. Look how cute. These are adorable. I don't know if you used the dye or if you made these from scratch, but they're super cute. And I love, like, the vintage -y theme she went with. 
and green and purple and stuff because I love that. All right, and then here's the 10 shaped boxes. Oh, she made me the little witches, the witch hats. Oh my God, I told her I love witches. So, you know, like the little witch hats that like push together that everybody like likes to do. Okay, and she decorated one for me so I knew kind of what to do. So she has all the pieces in here for me. And um, she put the adhesive on for me. There's like red line tape in, on here. Um, it's the little, I don't know if you can see it, but it's a little 3D witch hat. That is so cute. I didn't know that was a die. Is it a die or do you like make it from scratch? Do you guys know? I think it was something from Stampin' Up. I could be wrong, but let me know about the, the witch hat. I struggled with boxes because I didn't have like any box dies. I was like, what? It's like, how did I not have, I used to have a ton of dies, then I got rid of everything. And now I have like nothing. <laughs> I got rid of so much stuff for some, I made, I don't know, I was being stupid. Um, then here's her envelope. So she has 10 envelopes. So let's open these up so we can see the cute patterns. I love her little tags. I'm going to reuse them. They're so cute. Um, so she made some envelopes. So there's, and she put the little poison, like the different poison labels on them. So there's two script ones with some blood splatter on them. There's two with this really cool pattern. This red one. Spider web, and then there's this one, and this one, super cute. So basically the point of this is to have packaging materials for swaps and for gifts and things to use. Okay, so here's her 10 toppers. So she made them all like this, like with like a little handle. So it says happy Halloween, super cute, there's another one, there's a purple one, there's the dark green, wait I have it backwards, there we go, then the skinnier green and some more purple and then she has some like thicker ones here, so she did different like thicknesses and then this one and I like that they're like long and big because they're good for like the bigger, they're good for the bigger packages. Um, then here's her 10 bags, so she made them out of book paper, which is super cool. I think, yeah, look, they're made out of book paper and she just stressed all of them. Look how cool! So, which way do they open? Ah, they open like this, look. She made like little pockets, these are gonna be cute! Oh my god, I'm gonna make like little loaded pockets out of these. And I'm gonna do some stitching on them. I'm going to do some stitching on them. Oh my god, that's so cool. I'm going to do some stitching, and I'm going to make them into like little mini loaded envelopes. That is so cute. Or I can put goodies in here, and then I'll just like sew it shut. Look at me, getting ideas already for packaging. So cute, that's such a great idea, thank you. I love that idea, and it's steal that and then I'm gonna put them I'm gonna put these all back in here because I love that she put them in here and this is how they're gonna go down here in my studio so I literally have like no room down there right now but <laughs> this is how it's gonna go back in because it's nice and organized and my cat's coming through and I'll do the die cuts so I'll put them back in the their container okay so let's go on to this one so here's her little sequin mix. Super cute, she put in a little container. And then, if the broom fits right it. Oh, look how cute. So we had to include, I think a pack of bling. So, and then like a little thing of, like a package of gems. So she has purple bling and then all these little gems in here and some hearts. And then she has some bling mesh in here such a cute container 
I love saving little containers from things I buy and things and using them. I love it. Okay. And then here's the washi. Oh, look, she put it on a cute little jump ring. Oh my god, I'm already at 15 minutes and I've barely gotten through anything. So this might be two parts. Um, she tied some ribbon on the binder ring. Look how cute. I can just put this on my little thing. So she has, I don't have these stupid little thread things. I need to get them. But she has the skeleton. We have a happy Halloween with the skull face. I love this bat one from Michaels. Some polka dots. And then she has the purple pendants like banner I believe those are from Dollar Tree if I, I think I think they're from Dollar Tree oh no I like ripped the bag no come on go back in there okay so there's her washi and then here's her crepe paper so she did um she laminated like a card that's what it looks like like with pattern paper it's a laminated card and she has black, orange, and purple. 